my friends. The problem is, when I say hello, my friend, he thinks I'm talking to him. But Bruno, I wanted to talk about the puzzle. I wanted to talk to people about why I like to do puzzles because it forces me to relax my mind and to do this phenomenological exercise of just scanning all the pieces of the puzzle for the bit that will fit. And sometimes you do that by shape, sometimes by size, sometimes by color, and sometimes simply because you get a feel for it and you think, this piece is just gonna fit right there. And it seems to me this is very much like life, where we go about the world picking up different pieces of information and experience, and they kind of are scattered about in our minds until we start to form a picture and put them together and create something out of that that gives us a sense of where we're going and what the overall picture might be. Of course, life is much more complex than a 2D puzzle where there is just one picture and it is very much defined in space and time as something very limited. Whereas life itself has so many different layers and so many different moments and so many different perspectives on everything that it really is quite confusing sometimes to gather the pieces and to know where they go. But when we do that, it feels very satisfying because then we don't feel confused anymore and we don't feel lost anymore. We have a sense of how it fits together and how our life is beginning to make meaning for us. So I like to practice with my puzzles, but I practice in everyday life as well. I hope you might give it a go and try to practice with putting the pieces of your life together too, my friend. Sometimes they won't fit, but eventually, always will. Take care.